Josh, anxious to get a, uh, a home stand going after a, a long road trip? Yeah, it was, uh, it was a long, long road trip. Uh, uh, I mean, yeah, it was uh, kind of a tough little stretch at the start, but I um, thought we played some good hockey, especially in, uh, in Vegas, played a really strong game and, um, you know, obviously played a really good game in St. Louis too. And nice to get rewarded for that. So uh, it's definitely nice to be home and, and get in front of our fans. The way the trip ended in particular in St. Louis with the results you got makes you want to get this thing underway as quickly as possible. Yeah, I think so. Um, I think it's fair to say that's a quick turnaround, you know, getting back from the road trip and now playing tonight. But um, for sure, we're feeling good right now. Uh, so, like I said, a couple of good games in a row, and um, guys are feeling good, um, feeling loose, having fun. So that's uh, that's what it's all about. What was it like trying to just get yourself back up to speed throughout the, the length of the road trip? Um, yeah, it was good. I mean, um, did the best I could. Uh, Definitely felt better the last uh, last couple of games, just my timing and um, you know my pace and, and things like that, and and how I want to play. Obviously, I need to use my legs to. That's a big part of my game. So, felt like it came around the last two games, especially in St. Louis, and um, thought our line was was really good. And um, you know, obviously, our team played a really strong game too. But it's uh, it's definitely nice to to kind of feel back to normal now. <laughs> yeah, I uh, I didn't even know he was going to be skating with us today, let alone be in a no contact jersey. So. That was, uh, it's great to see. Obviously, we miss him, and um, he looked really good out there. I was joking around with him, asking if he was going to play tonight. But um, yeah, it's, uh, it's nice to see that he's getting closer, and, and he's feeling good. So that's a huge positive for us. Tonight's your 100th game. Um, you know, when you look back on the first 99, what kind of progress do you feel like you've made? Um, I think I've made a lot of progress. Um, you know, from, from game one, my first call up, or my first, you know, stint. Um, after my first year pro to, to now, I think I've made a lot of big strides and um, I think just my confidence has grown and obviously I'm, I'm put in a really good spot to, to succeed every night, but um, <laughs> I, uh, it's, it's been great. I think uh, coaches have been great with me. Um, I think I've grown in you know, pretty much every aspect of the game. And um, like I said, with, with my game being a 200 foot game, I think that's huge and um, just uh, been very fortunate to have people um, you know, want to help me get better. and. I think a big part of that is just being a listener, and I've uh, tried to do the best I can, so just uh, want to keep getting better. Josh, as an athlete, I'm sure you set goals, and when you started in the league, where do you want to be for 100 games? Where did you see yourself as an athlete at this point? <laughs> I mean, when I got my first couple of games, I wasn't really looking down the line to see where I wanted to be at my 100th game, but um, I mean, it's not a crazy amount of games, but it is, you know, it's 100 games. Like it's, it's, I guess it's a, a good little milestone to hit, and um, Definitely exciting, and um, like I said to Bruce, just you know, want to keep getting better. It's a super short stint, but um, you know, we're in a unique spot here, and and all the young guys are you know coming up together, and um, I think we're starting to to find our game a little bit. So I just um, you know want to keep adding to that. Josh, you're a big part of it, but what's been making the uh, the power play click the last uh, three games here? Um, I don't know. I was just joking with Timmy before I came up here. Maybe we should have him him up top running. Running where Shabby is, um, but I think it's been good. Everyone's kind of just doing their part. Whitey's been good. Um, Chucky does his thing in front, and um, I think it's just a collective group. And uh, we work for each other. That's the main thing. Um, you know, a lot of uh, you know retrieval stuff where you know you shoot the puck and you got to get it back, and, and that's how you get chances. And I think that's you know how we've been creating stuff. So just um, just work based and uh, just want to keep creating momentum. What has Colin White brought to that that unit right now? I think stability. Um, he's a really reliable player, super smart. Um, always know where he's going to be. He's very, very talkative out there, and that's um, you know obviously huge on a power play. So um, you know I, I think he's been huge. He uh, he can take draws too, which he's done a, a few times. And um, so like I said, yeah, he's just a nice stable piece for us, and he's been really good. Increase in attendance going to help uh, the energy level over the next little while. Yeah, I mean I would think so. It's. Uh, I mean, for me personally, I haven't played at home in a while just from being injured and stuff like that. So I'm definitely uh, super excited to, to get back in front of our fans. And um, yeah, it, it's 100%, I think, right? The capacity. Yeah, so um, it should be good. And hopefully, uh, you know, we get a good, get a good crowd tonight and, and uh, you know, start this homestand, um, you know, off on a good point. You were rehabbing and <coughs> there were, what, 500 fans here? And you guys were kind of sitting down on the 100 level. Like, did you have any good any interactions with some of the fans that were in the building there? Some, some were. Yeah, we actually did because um, uh, we were so close to the fans. Um, everyone was just walking right by us, so we were, you know, taking pictures and 
stuff like that. And then, um, you know, once it got to, I think, 50%, we went upstairs just because it was getting a little crowded. But, um, yeah, it was cool to kind of interact with fans like that and, and get a little bit more personal and um, just show kind of uh, the, the non-hockey part of us, uh, you know, as a human being. So, uh, yeah, it was fun.